Welcome to our Five on Five. We're pleased to be joined by Joanna Tu, the Employment Coordinator for Compass House right here in downtown Medford. Joanna, thanks for being here. Welcome. Thank you so much. Thanks for being here again. So uh, Compass House, in case anybody doesn't know, what is that organization? Compass House is a community within a community helping people with mental illness to recover. And the whole process is about recovery through work. Okay, and, and work as an employment coordinator, that's, that's part of your gig. Uh, there's an employment opportunity for individuals that traditionally may have had a difficult time getting back into the workplace. Tell us about this. There is. Um, let me speak to first the recovery through work, though. It's not just through employment outside in the community, but also work within the clubhouse. And we base our day on an eight to five structured work day. We meet in the morning and the afternoon, and everything that we do at the clubhouse is done side by side, staff and member from cleaning the restrooms to grant writing. Hmm. But then there comes a time when a lot of people who have been stigmatized and beaten down and, and think that they can't work anymore finally get to the point from working in the clubhouse where they say, hey, I'm ready to go back to work. What can we do? Okay. Oftentimes, that doesn't really mean they're independent employed, but through transitional employment. Okay, and so what type of transit, what is transitional employment and how did you get to that classification? Uh, transitional employment is exactly that. It's a transition back into the workplace. Um, it's usually a six to nine month position, 12 to 20 hours a week at at least minimum wage. Um, the really fantastic thing about transitional employment is it's not based on skills that they may or may not have already learned, things that they necessarily want to learn, but basically just saying, hey, I'm ready to go back to work. Um, we ask then that the employers that we're working with hand over hiring that position to us, and we choose from our members that have said they're ready to go back. Um, at that time then, I have program managers that are going in to whatever position it is. They train for two weeks and get that position down, and then we bring in the member and we train the member for one, two weeks, however long it takes. Um, transitional employment is really fantastic for the employer because we guarantee that if for whatever reason our member can't make it in due to a mental health day or a sick day, they're actually physically ill, that those program managers will then come in and work that day, two days, week, or month so that you're always guaranteed coverage. Interesting. Okay, very good. We're going to take a quick break. We'll have much more in a moment. Stay with us. Welcome back to our Five on Five. Again, we're here with Joanna Tu, the employment coordinator at Compass House. So Joanna, you were talking about how you're looking for uh, employers to create a position uh, to, to give to Compass House that you guys would then hire from one of your members. How is, how is that legal for them to uh, bypass the public, if you will? Um, they're not really bypassing the public. Like you said, it's creating a position specifically for Compass House. This would never be filled by anybody else. It's only a transitional employment position that we alone fill. So oftentimes, um, it's not uh, working a full eight-hour shift. It's a five-hour shift doing entry-level work, filing papers, answering phones, janitorial, whatever it may be. Um, that would accommodate a transition back into the workplace. It doesn't mean they would bypass any background checks if that's what they have to do for them. Mm. Um, it just means they don't do the interviewing. They're not checking skills and that type of things. They're just trusting, if you will, um, on a gentleman's handshake mm -hmm. that we will choose somebody that's ready to go back to work. Okay, and, and how many members of the Compass House are, are looking for transitional work right now? Currently, I have six that have expressed interest in transitional employment. Okay, and uh, they have a variety of skills, or, or what, what, what type of skills do they have? You know, everybody has different skills, um, but the best part about transitional employment is, again, it's not based on the skills that they already have, okay. just the wanting to learn new skills. So they may have only had a construction background, but they want to go back to work, and they're ready to learn whatever is going on in a kitchen or... Um, in an office or mm -hmm. different things like that to build new skills, which is fantastic on a resume, and then of course getting new references to add to a resume that may otherwise be kind of um, vague or have holes in it. Okay, and as you talked about, entry level. Type Absolutely. Work. Okay. Yes. Now, if any employers are out there, anybody's interested in finding out more, they can go to the website. Absolutely, you can go to www.socompasshouse.org. You can call us 
at 541-973-2840 or come by Compass House. We're at 332 West 6th Street and I would be glad to talk to you anytime. Right here in downtown Medford. Thank you Absolutely. so much, Joanna. Thank Great you so you. much. Appreciate it. Stay with us. We'll be right back.